Yes, we've been stuck here. We were due to fly home early hours of this morning and we checked the app as we were instructed to do so and were informed by Ryanair that um, the flight had been cancelled and we haven't heard anything from Ryanair since and we've spent literally all day, the last 10 hours almost, on the phone speaking to different customer advisors from Ryanair um, who quite honestly are quite incompetent and don't seem to know what's going on. There's been no help at all. Gosh. I mean, people are scratching their heads as to exactly what has happened with this. Initially, there was some kind of fear that our air infrastructure had been hacked, that we were part of some targeted attack. We haven't really had any confirmation on that. Then we were told it might have been a miscommunication between different air traffic control departments, which I don't think is acceptable. But the end result of it is that you, a traveller, a tourist, is stuck abroad twiddling your thumbs because nobody is telling you what's going on. Are you angry with Ryanair? I'm, I'm very angry and I feel very let down. I mean, we're a party of 10. It's a family holiday. We've had a lovely week. As I say, a family holiday, which, which incorporates adults and young children as well. And we've now managed to secure today our own accommodation starting from tomorrow at great expense, our own expense, which I hope is going to be honoured, you know, being paid back. Um, we've also spoken to Ryanair several times today. Uh, at one point this morning, we were even told there are no flights back from Malaga during September, which left us quite surprised, to say the least. Um, and then we were told, oh, yes, we can get you on a flight on Sunday at around 10 o'clock in the morning from an, air an airport two hours away. And then we got the confirmation through, and it was actually for Saturday, a uh, completely different day, completely different airport, and a different time to what we were told. So we had to get back on the phone again to confirm, because obviously we've got we've got no faith okay. in Ryanair at all, and we will never be flying with them again. No support at well, all. Well, I, I mean, I absolutely... I absolutely feel your pain. I know that loads of people will do. It will be no comfort to you to know that you are one of a couple of hundred thousand of people in a very similar boat. Ryanair have said this, and I'm going to read this yeah. to you. They say, yeah. passengers, pa passengers can expect some flight disruptions as we work to get our aircraft and crews back on schedule. We expect some flight cancellations and considerable flight delays. We apologise sincerely to customers for these cancellations and delays. Tanya, do you accept their apology? Not really, because um, it sounds very sincere, but when you speak to the customer advisors, and I work with the general public myself, and I pride myself on good customer service, and when you speak to them, they, they are incompetent. They don't seem to know what's going on, whether it's a training issue, okay. and they try to fob you off with certain um, phrases, and yeah. no, I don't accept it. It's just not good enough. Okay.